traumatic. That's the best way to describe one 12-year-old boy's life before and while living in foster care. This week's Wednesday's child is a quiet, funny kid looking for an outgoing family who can show him what it means to be loved. Hi, I'm Eric, and I am a very nice boy, but when someone messes with someone I love, I get very mad. While 12-year-old Eric is soft-spoken, he has quite the tough exterior built up by years and years of abuse. Some bruises are still in my body and from like years ago. He's been in foster care in Arkansas for about five years now. Stressful. That's how he describes his time in the system. Not only has Eric experienced trauma in his birth home, but also in foster homes he's lived in. Some foster parents I lived with, lived with they were racist and and I did not like him, so I had to move. These experiences have caused him to feel a lot of anger. Makes me mad and sad just thinking about it. He said that the first thing he would say to a family is about his mentioning his anger issues, and that's all he thinks about when it comes to himself. And he doesn't see or understand that he's much more than his anger issues. Eric's adoption specialist says he's working through this past trauma in therapy. The fact that he's working on them at such a a young age, I think that he will grow out of a lot of that. And um, if he is in a less stressful environment that he's not triggered as often, then I think that will completely go away. He's also found an outlet in doing the things he enjoys. Back flips, front flips, uh, football, basketball, uh, soccer. Eric would like to find a family with similar interests. I want them to accept who I am. Oh, and he has one other stipulation. I want a dog. I want a dog. <laughs> I want a pug. <laughs> They're silly. He's so sweet and he's loving and he's very deserving of a home. And I think that anybody who had him would love him. When asked what he'd want a family thinking of adopting him to know, this is what Eric had to say. I would just be so happy. And it would just make me, make me burst into tears because I've never had someone say that to me. And I do not know what it's like being adopted. I just think it, 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 It'll take the anger away. So deserving of a loving family. If you're interested in adopting Eric or any of the children we featured in our Wednesday's Child Series, we've got a link on krk.com. And as always, we'd like to thank Lion Legal for supporting us in our efforts to try to find every Wednesday's child a loving family.